The stunning admission that some 11 million Volkswagen diesel vehicles were circumventing emission controls, and not just the half million cars in the United States, is taking a toll on VW's reputation. So let's be clear about this. Our company was dishonest with the EPA and the California Air Resources Board, and with all of you. And in my German words, we have totally screwed up. The initial impact is being felt in VW's share price, down 31 percent since the crisis began. Bigger troubles may lie ahead as the probe widens. There could be fines from other countries because as of this morning, South Korea, Italy, France, Germany and other countries have said we are now going to check to make sure that these vehicles do meet diesel standards and this will impact all the diesel vehicles. By installing software that switches diesel engines to a cleaner mode during emissions testing, certain VW models were able to achieve performance gains while emitting as much as 40 times the legal pollution limit. Analysts say that could mean consumers will be seeking compensation for vehicles that don't deliver on their promises. Once the vehicles are available for recall, it will be a software upgrade. That upgrade could impact fuel economy by one to two miles to the gallon. It also could impact the performance of the vehicle. In a video Tuesday, CEO Martin Winterkorn apologized for the deception. Angesichts der schwierigen Lage jetzt darum, German volle Chancellor Transparenz Angela zu zeigen, Merkel den has demanded full transparency from the company. Und, uh, Shareholders might be demanding CEO more, including the ousting of Winterkorn. Luke Sheridan, The Associated Press.